Although there's no ribbon cutting date set yet, the owner of Two Chicks and a Hammer says she's hoping to open up her Noblesville location sometime next year. You might recognize her if you've ever caught an episode of HGTV's Good Bones. The show followed Mina Starziak Hawk and her mother, Karen Lane, as they rehabilitated more than 100 Indianapolis homes. A few years ago, they opened a retail storefront, but Starziak Hawk says making it through the pandemic was challenging enough for small businesses, and now not enough customers are returning to stores. We had the people traveling and that's amazing and I think they'll still travel to Noblesville and see the historic downtown. It's such a cool area. Um, but what we really needed was the neighborhood support. She's hoping to find that support in Noblesville and eventually start some renovation projects there. Mayor Chris Jensen was on board right away. We have the unique job of making sure that our downtown in particular stays the unmatched authentic community that it has been for the past 200 years. I think a partner like Mina appreciates that. Starziak Hawk says it became too challenging and time consuming to complete projects in Indianapolis. When you know you could potentially when I started do a build from start to finish in four months. Now it's much more realistic that it takes a year with the bureaucracy of it. Some people living in the neighborhoods featured on Good Bones worried it would gentrify the area and push existing communities out. Starziak Hawk wants to dispel that idea, saying they focused on empty, dilapidated properties. A lot of times people don't like change. It's scary, it's different, they don't want it, and it seems like the city is really on board because Mayor Jensen and his team have a good plan for balancing the old with the new in a way that seems really respectful of the people that have been here for a long time. The mayor added he plans to prioritize preserving the city, protecting those who call it home, and ensuring the process of building is streamlined. As for whether Starziak Hawk will ever return to television. We'll never say never to anything because I'm in the suburbs and I never thought I would be out here. <laughs> in Noblesville, Scarlett O'Hara, Fox 59 News.